figure we all saw you get hit so many times. What is it like to go physically to go through that? Uh, I mean, in the middle of a game, your adrenaline's kind of going. So I mean, it's not till tonight, tomorrow, I really feel those hits. Uh, but physically, I mean, sometimes some are worse than others. But um, yeah, I mean, sometimes they hurt, sometimes they don't. You ever think, okay, maybe I, I need to step out for a couple plays here? Uh, no, I mean, I, I, I usually know if it's something real serious, bad, that I need to step out. Uh, but uh, you know, I've, I felt like I could stay in and, and, and be all right. Yes, he had some drops as well. Were you frustrated at all? I mean, yeah. I mean, it was it's frustrating, but I mean, anytime uh, yeah, you lose, it it, it stinks. But uh, you know, we we just gotta look, go back and look at the the tape, look at the film, and, and see what we can learn from and where we can do better at. I was said he was proud of your teammates. Kind of got your back on that on that slide play. Yeah. And that, what did you feel about that? That's awesome. I mean, they they had my back, and you know, I, I knew they would. And, Guys like you know Carlos, thanks uh, that he got ejected, but um, it shows he's got my back, and you know I really appreciate that. And so does you know all the other guys went at him as well. Looks like you took a forearm on the on the chin on that one, CJ. Is that is that probably the most painful hit you had today? Yeah. Uh, no, actually the the most uh, painful hit wasn't even really a hit. It was when I was throwing uh, at somebody's helmet with my thumb. That, that was the most painful thing, but. Uh, yeah, I mean, my neck got twisted around, but um, on the one where they, the false start, uh, that that one, I mean, didn't feel great. But that's the one where you hit the guy's helmet. No, that uh, that's not the one where I hit. The, I'm I'm talking about a different one now. Oh yeah. Yeah. On the last interception, it bounces off of Trent's helmet. Were you just trying to almost kill that? One? I was just trying to get it in the ground. Yeah, just throw it away. Yeah, and yeah. Offense so scored ten points for the third game in a row. Mm -hmm. What's preventing it from taking strides the last few weeks? Uh, I think we're just, I mean, the opportunities are there. We just aren't making them. I mean, the first, you know, Dallas, we were in the red zone a couple of times and, um, you know, fumbled. And then today uh, we got down there. Um, then we had a penalty, kicked us back. And we just got to be able to finish when we're starting moving the ball. We just got to be able to finish drives and uh, and get get the points on the board. We've seen quarterbacks in this league, especially young ones, get kind of shelled so often, mm -hmm. how do you stop that from happening? Keep your confidence up, you know. You know you're getting sacked and getting hit. You know? Yeah, I mean that's one thing that I'm not. I'm not afraid of getting hit, uh, so that won't that won't affect me. Uh, it never has. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm tough and I've, I've been able to take things. Obviously, if I'm injured, then I then I won't force myself in there. But you know, as of now, I you know, I haven't been injured. So, a couple of the back up. What was the communication like on the sideline with him? I was good. I mean, he was real supportive and, uh, you know, helping me out and talking with the quarterback's coach. And uh, whenever I wanted to warm up, throw, he, he was there and ready to throw. He, he was helpful.